Hello everybody and welcome back to City Skylands. And today we're starting the game a little bit differently. Um, I have put on a, a few cool mods that I found in the workshop that seem pretty good. Um, and yeah, there's a bunch of them. So you can download maps and stuff, which is kind of cool. So all these maps we've got here, but we can download some um, like awesome ones that people have made and save games and stuff, which is pretty cool. There's assets. Um, all of these are turned on. So these are a bunch of assets are downloaded, so I've downloaded... Um, uh, a large water intake, or a cycling center, a metro, um, a four-track train station, a skate park. There's all different buildings we can put down. There's so many really cool ones. So, yeah, we're going to chuck them in. Um, hopefully, don't break the game. And then they're putting some actual mods that do stuff. So, the extended public transport user interface um, means we've got all kinds of new stuff to look at there. We've got the first-person camera mod. Which seems like fun, so we can walk around the city in first person, see what it looks like. Um, we've got enable achievements, which means achievements work while mods are on. Um, and traffic plus plus, so we can add zonable pedestrian paths, other traffic improvements. So basically, we can stop like, the traffic problem, hopefully. This might solve it, right? So um, we can we can adjust all these ones, these actually got options. So allow trucks in pedestrian roads, allow residents in pedestrian roads, disable central lane on pedestrian roads. No despawn by, don't know what the hell that is. Um, beta test realistic speeds and beta test road customizer tool. Beta test um, improved AI, right? So let's do this. We we'll improve AI, ghost mode. Disables all mod functionality, leaving only enough logic to load the map. Right, let's, let's try the road customizer tool with the realistic speeds um, and. Uh, ah! Sure, let's save that and see how that goes. Um, so yeah, let's get into our world and see if it doesn't break. If we can actually load the mods in. I should, it should, I should be able to add the mods in. It should be fine. Um, so we should have all these new mods to play around with. Yay! So that is basically going to be today. Playing around with mods and hoping our city grows. There's some really cool ones. And if you guys like the mods, I'll add a bunch more in each episode. Uh, uh, cool buildings I find. Because it just means there's like loads more to do with the game. And I'll be actually be able to make... The pretty area of my city, finally, I'll actually be able to make pretty because there's some really cool buildings that look really nice. Um, so yeah, I'll, I'll show you. There's some really sweet stuff. So we can have like a centralized train station and stuff, like a proper main line with like four train tracks coming out of it. Should be sweet. Should be sweet as hell. So yeah, that's what we're going to do. And hopefully we can solve the fucking traffic problem with the traffic plus plus. Um, but we'll see. So yeah, the game looks a little while to load in, but it's not too bad. Um, educated citizens generate less garbage. Well, that's, I did not know that. I should probably read these things when I load in the game. Almost tab out. Um, that's that's an interesting fact. I guess it kind of makes sense because they recycle more. But yeah, well, now we have larger recycling centers um, and stuff that we can put down, which should hopefully reduce the um, the backlog of rubbish, which sometimes happens for no reason. That's mainly down to traffic, though. So uh, we'll have to see. Um, but recycling's good. Um, I've done all my zoning wrong as well for traffic. But look, we'll figure it out. We'll figure out. All these cool sweet mods. I think he's trying to load them in now. So yeah, um, we'll be jump back when we're actually in game. Okay, we're in, and um, we can instantly have a look at some of the new stuff we've got going. So um, the game isn't paused. Uh, traffic. Well, oh, there's all kinds of icons and stuff here. What is this? This is new. Is this new or is this always here? Oh, I think this is always here. Was it? Was that actually always there? I think my brain's just melting. Oh god, maybe this wasn't always here. Is this a mod? No specialization in Butler Heights. Um, that's obviously because it's not a residence. So oh god, oh wait, god, you can set the policies for the zones, can't we? Um, I totally forgot. Um, okay, no, we don't want to worry about that. Um, right, so let's get the new a the extended travel AI up, which is um, public transport, and then we can click on like public transport, so tube. Ooh! Okay, so we can see... Um, who trips save 23% so what lines do what so we've got um, uh, Metro line 1 442 passengers which is can we zoom into the Metro line line color they're all green so we can color the lines now as well which makes things way easier so this is actually really cool I didn't think you could do this before no so you can color the lines so Metro line 1 which is my first line carries 442 pa this is a really in-depth detail actually um, Metro Line 2 carries, um, oh, is it actually pointing, oh, let's locate it on the map. Focus. Oh, okay, it actually focuses on it. Well, sweet. So Metro Line 2 is this one, I'm guessing, right? Um, Metro, where's Metro Line 1 then? Uh, this one. 
I don't know what that actually means. I need to colour it. Let's change the colour of it so we can see what it is. Blue. No, actually, let's go pink. Okay, pink. Um, I cannot see a pink. Oh, it's showing the train is pink. Ah, okay. So, that's line one, the pink trains. Ah, so we should colour all the lines so we know what lines are what. That would be kind of handy, actually. So, we've got a blue train, a cyan train. Um, we'll have a... Um, a red train. I've got all the colours in the world. We can do this. A red train. We'll have one green train. We'll have a um, a yellow train. Yeah. We'll have a oh 556 out of 10. Oh 500. Oh 506. I think right. So what the first one is? First number is um, citizens. The second number is tourists. So this is cool. I like this. this is really handy. Uh, oh, it's dragged over. Oh, it's because over here. Um, well, this one's got a lot of people using it, but I guess this is like the super busy part of the city. So, um, line color can be, um, dark purple. Ooh. Oh, now the lines actually showed up dark purple. Oh, look, the lines are actually adjusting now. Look, the, the colors of the lines are changing. Oh, sweet. So, you can see, look, it's so much easier to see the different colors now. This looks so beautiful like this, doesn't it? Oh, I like it. So, yeah, we can click that. We can see what the buses are doing. Buses aren't too great. I, the bus routes are just shit. But you can see where the buses are going, though. Look. So you can see them going... Oh, that's the underground. Oh, you can see the trains. That's so cool. Then there's the um, boats we haven't got. Regular trains. So, train line 183, 161, 161. So, yeah. We're not we're not saying... Um, doing much there. Uh, I think our underground system is pretty damn good. I think we should upgrade that at some point. But now, with the underground system... If I just get off of this... Oh, God. The traffic here is so bad. We may need to use traffic plus plus to fix this in a minute. Um, got oh my lordy lord! Yeah, this is uh, atrocious. Like, so you need like to implement lane discipline and stuff, uh, so you can add that to roundabouts. This is just a fucking nightmare. Like, this isn't even a ro like. Look at the state of it. Okay, so um, I don't actually know how to do. Oh god, here it is. Road customizer tool. Okay. So vehicle uh, and speed restrictions. So hover over rows to display their lanes. Um, left click to toggle um, the selection of lanes. Right click to clear current selection. Um, with lanes selected, set vehicles and speed restrictions user in the user menu. Lane changer. Um, hover over the roads and find an intersection. Um, then click edit. Uh, or click to edit it. Okay. Um, entry points can be shown. Click one to select it and right click goes back and click. Click the exit routes you wish to allow. Use page up and page down to toggle the underground view. Okay. Um, so we can select the speed limits. Oh, this is cool. Oh, we needed this, right? Let's see if we can fix this bloody fucking junction, right? So, um, so we've got all these lanes, right? So, like, what the hell is it? So, what can we do here? We can have... Oh, we can have lanes for certain vehicles, right? So, this can be... Um, so, we can have lanes only for emergency, right? So, that's only emergency. And then... All these other lanes can be other stuff, right? But this lane has to be emergency. Then, then this lane here as well, that can be emergency, right? So we can set an emergency lane on the outside, which means tr ah, that's such a good idea. Emergency, okay. Um, emergency. So we'll set an emergency lane on the outside where only emergency services can use, and that should solve traffic problems. And then we'll set this lane to be an emergency lane as well. So here can be emergency only. If I can select it. And this should stop fire and death and all kinds of problems, right? So that's emergency only. Does that mean emergency only? Does that mean it removes that? So, um... Or oh, does this mean it's not... Oh, it means it's not allowed. Okay, so we want this to be only emergency. There we go. That's So we've actually selected it so emergency services can't use that lane. Which is not what we want. Um... Okay, so yeah, we've got that there. I think, okay, I think we've got it right on that. And then all the rest of these. Oh, no, we don't want that. Um, so we selected that so that only emergency services can use that lane. Yeah, everybody is going in that lane. I'm slightly confused. Um, why can only emergency services... What? Is this working? Um, the traffic is worse than ever. Uh, does it need to just adjust? I'm not sure. Oh god, there's a fire here and nobody can get to it because... Right, um... I'm not sure if that's working. I want it to be so... Let's have a look. So I want this lane here to be emergency service only as well. Right? 
So that's what we've done. And then all these other lanes. Can we like choose? Oh god, I undid it all. No, I undid it all. Oh, was it because I didn't actually tab out of it and click save? Maybe that was it. Um, oh, shit. Right, let's just try this. So we'll try and have this lane here to be... Right, it's currently 60 miles an hour. It's fine. Emergency, oh, it is emergency service only because that's what we got selected before. So, huh, and huh. So the outside lane is emergency services only. Okay. Emergency only. Alright, so that should stop problems on the round built. Or at least for the emergency services, right? And then if I exit off this, it should mean that everyone filters out of this lane. Right? No? Wrong. Um this hasn't helped at all. I don't know what I'm doing! Oh, this is gonna take some experimentation, guys. So I click on junctions and oh, oh no, has that done it now? Do I need to click on the junctions to do it? I don't know. Let's get this up again. So uh, I now can also no longer click on lanes. What have I done? Wait, hang on. Have I told it so that nobody can use this except? Oh god, the traffic logs got even worse. What the fuck is going on? I put on smart AI traffic as well. It just doesn't seem to. Well, a fire engine is going around now. All good. Oh, what the hell is all this stuff? Oh god, this is so confusing. There's like little blobs here as well of colour, which I can go. Oh Jesus, so we can like say which lanes they. Oh my god, that's. What is this? Okay, right, traffic is an issue. I may have to learn this one a bit, but um. Uh. Why can't I not select the lanes anymore? Oh, okay, I can. So all of these lanes are just blue and this one's green. Um, but this hasn't solved anything. It's made things worse. I don't understand. How do I colour in other lanes a different colour? Alright, so this should be emergency only. And it's not. The buses and shit. All kinds of shit's in it. Um, oh god, this is so... What do I... Okay, right. We're going to figure this out, guys. Just like that's green. No, not on that. Uh, fuck, should I just select them all again? Why not? It doesn't seem to make any like sense because you can't select certain lanes for certain things. So you've got to go like this, and then oh, oh god, what have I done here? I clicked on the road. Oh god, what the hell is all this? Like, where, how did I get this up? And I right click again. There's all kinds of different options. Left click, left click, right click, right. I don't understand. There's so many options. So we can like, it's so weird. So you can, you can say where traffic flows. You can have this to have to flow over to here. So you can you can set up lanes basically. I think so. This has to flow into this lane, and then to do like that, and then from here, if I can select the junction, it's not letting me select the junction. Well, we've done. So yeah, cars are flying around this way now from this lane. This lane they have to flow into the middle lane. And then this lane they have to flow into this lane. Alright. That's the rules. That is the rules. And then this lane they can either flow. But this lane they have to go left. This lane they have to go straight on. Alright. This lane they have to go straight on. Okay, there we go. Uh, okay, and then. And let's sort out these fucking junctions. Maybe that will solve some of the problems. So this lane, if I can select here somewhere, which I can't for some reason. Um, why can't I not select this one? Oh god, the traffic buildup is immense. Um, here we go. So we can do this one. So this one, they've got to go right. Oh, they all have to go right here. So right. Right. Oh, if I can see. There we go. And right. Okay, so this one, they've got to go. Oh, they are actually flowing the right way with the traffic anyway. It's just a bit weird. Left, 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 wait, no, left, left, on. In fact, no, that's going to be terrible, let's get rid of this one. No, get rid of this one. No, no, no. So now they have to, they're just ignoring it anyway. They're just not even, okay, oh, now, now they're following it, okay. But actually don't, oh, so they can go left or straight on, okay. Yeah, that makes sense, okay, good. Nope, can I do that? Apparently, I cannot. Um, ah! 
I want to disconnect this one. Oh god, I don't know what I'm doing. Right, we're just going to leave this guy. Oh my god, I think I've made a fucking mess of it. It's got even worse. The traffic has got even... I know this, we can like flow how traffic comes out of these things. So there's a junction here, apparently. So... Um, I don't really understand how any of this works, though, to be honest. Like, I can't even... It flows around to like there or some shit. No, does that, that looks wrong. Oh god, how do I can't... Undo! Undo! I've made a mess. Right, well... We're just gonna we're just gonna ignore that for now. But yeah, that's this experiment. We've got to experiment with some of the mods to find out what to do. Playing with traffic's fine anyway. It's just I think I've made it even worse than it ever was. Um, the population is still growing. These roundabouts are just fucked. I just don't even know what to do with these. Um, maybe I need to look up like a tutorial on how to get these to run properly. Um, so none of these underground stations are powered, which means I don't think they're actually operational, which is kind of sucky. Um, but our population is slowly still climbing for some reason. Sixty thousand people. Boom. Alright, oh, there's a police problem here. Crime. I oh, know all the roads go, so we can actually control lanes and all kinds of shit, but it's just very confusing. Um, but on all of them, look. We can do it on every single road. That's going to get maybe irritating, I don't know. Oh, sorry, there's the first person camera mod here, so we can control this. I might have a look at this. Um, so, toggle uh, to hotkey first person, tab, okay. Um, show cursor. Um, go faster, speed multiplier. Field of view, uh, movement multiplier, movement speed, uh, snap to ground, ground distance. All right, let's just try this. So we hit tab to go to first person. Um, and let's see what goes down. So let's go into the heart of our city. It's going to be so weird going down into the heart of our city. Let's hit tab. And oh, we can go right down to street view. <gasps> oh, oh, God. Hang on. So we're like right down on the ground here. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm... I'm going to tab to exit, but then I'm going to change the settings so that we snap to ground. There we go. And that seems good to me. And I don't want movement speed so crazy fast. I want, I want to like walk around the city like a person. Okay, field of view 45. That sucks. We need a, like 90. That's like actual FOV. 80, 90. Okay, let's try this. And tab. Oh. Okay, we snap to the ground. We're in a building somewhere. Oh, we're walking around. Look at this. We're going a bit quick. I want to be walking speed. Oh, this is so cool! This is so cool! Okay, hang on, right. Um, let's change our movement speed even slower, right? We're going way too quick. It needs to be like 2.5, so we're actually walking. Okay, hotkey to go faster. Okay, caps locks. Okay, right, so we want to hit tab. Right, oh, we didn't shut off the thingy. Shut off the menu. Resume game. Shut the menu off. Okay, hit tab again. So it just spawns us like, on the ground near where we are. Okay, so yeah, now we're walking speed. Look at this. So we can hold, um, what was it to go faster? Caps locks, that was it. So we can like sort of run. Oh, this is awesome. Ooh, hello. Oh, God. Hello there. Oh, this is so cool. I didn't even realize there was actually detail to like the people on the ground. Oh, my God. This is amazing. This is so cool. Hello. Ooh. Oh, we're going to have to spend the whole next episode just walking around the city. Sports car going by. Oh, look, there's actually quite a lot of people. Let's just cross the road. Let's not look. Um, cross the road. Oh, this is awesome. Look at this bus stop. With full there's actually a lot of people using this bus stop, actually. Kids with skateboards. This is really goddamn cool. Looking up at the skyline. Oh, wow. It's so weird seeing your city from the ground. It's like a totally different feeling. Oh, my God. I actually love it. So we're like we're going just slightly faster walking pace. This is awesome. But the bus is going. It'd be so cool if you get a ride on the bus. That'd be awesome. This is sweet. So just like cruising down the street. This is so cool. Oh my god. I love this. Tyrell Hotels. Oh, that's a big one. There's all this stuff that you don't even notice, like when you're just scanning over. Oh god, we can go down the side alleys. Oh my god. There's like cars parked here. What the hell is all this stuff? This is amazing. I didn't even know. Look, there's little, there's little like cars parked back here. Like for people working. Oh, this is just epic. I'm sort of walking. This is, I'm, I'm actually just staggered here. Wow, so we just tried to cut through, through burned bean coffee. This is a massive coffee house. Whoa. Can we go inside? If it was rendered inside, it'd be hilarious. Oh, unfortunately, it's an empty shell, but you can't have everything. There's cars parked on the streets. 
this I didn't realise how cool this game actually was. Oh my god. Okay, right. I think I'm gonna leave it here. Next episode we're gonna have some first person fun. And for now, thanks for watching and bye bye.